Hey guys, so we have a bit of a problem concerning Andromeda and the solution is to bang your head against the wall several times and cry. But no, really, um, we do have a problem, but first let me say that with the problem there is a solution. Uh, just well, Okay, so what basically is going to happen is I'm going to tell you what the problem is, how it came about, and how I'm going to fix it. But it's going to require your understanding, I guess. Um, just so you know what's going on. So, I took my setup with me. I got my new job, right? The, so the problem, this is the problem. I mean, the problem isn't that I have a new job. The new job is great. But I took my setup with me for the first time ever to the hotel where I'm staying at. And I decided to play Andromeda because it's brand spanking new and everything. You know, I wanted to play it. So I brought it with me and I set everything up exactly how I had it at home. And I played approximately 30 hours I haven't actually checked the exact number yet I'm doing this really rushed in the morning because we have an extended hour break um, but yeah no okay so the first I'll just straight up the problem it's been too long okay okay so the problem is that the last 30 hours or so of gameplay that I have that I recorded while at the hotel has no game audio no zilch nothing there's nothing i've looked everywhere i've looked in all the audio files there's nothing there uh my commentary let's just say this thank heavens for the blessings um is my commentary is intact my initial blind commentary is intact the game visuals are fine there's no game audio whatsoever for the last 30 or so hours of recording um and when i figured this out when i was at home because i'm okay well, first things off it was my fault. I'm an idiot. I should have checked the recordings. I went to a new place, set my setup up in a, in a completely different area, and didn't even think to check the recordings after I recorded at least one. So that was my bad, and that was stupid. And so yeah, so I, again, something, I always do this though, is why I will never make the most fantastic videos ever, because I never think to double check my recordings ever until something bad happens. Um, but yeah, so I got home, uploaded one of the episodes that I recorded in the hotel, and there was no game audio. The, so that's the problem. Um, I, the, the, the reason it happened, so bullet point number two, is that how it happened. Um, at home, I use my, my headset has two different audio out, outputs. One of them is just an audio cable, and the other one is a USB. I usually plug the USB into the 360, so that way, and then the audio output into the TV, so that way I don't have to change my headsets. I don't have to plug and unplug things when I'm, you know, switching between the 360 and the PC. At the hotel, I hated having an extra cord laying around. So I plugged the, not only did I plug the, uh, the audio output cable into the TV, I also plugged the USB cable into the PC for my headphones. So what normally happens is the audio will go basically i'm hearing it out of the tv so the audio for the game travels from the pc through the hdmi cables to the elgato capture card through the elgato capture card capture card hdmi cable into the tv where it then comes out the audio output cable into my ears uh but what i did by plugging the usb um audio cable basically into the pc was circumvent the Elgato and the audio was going straight into my ears instead of through the Elgato and it's something I didn't even notice didn't even think to check because I had never had a problem with it before it's never something I've I've done before and so I was like oh boy like it took me and my sister we chatted a bit and we finally figured out what was wrong because I had to call her in to talk me off the ledge when I figured out what was going on I was like duh I'm gonna die so we talked about it and we figured out, so I know, the, I know the, the problem and I won't do it again, right? I won't plug the USB into the PC ever again. Um, but now the solution is a little bit more involved and some of you might think it's a little bit crazy. Uh, but my plan, because the key here, and maybe some of you have already given up at this point because it's gotten kind of long, but uh, the plan is to keep the original commentary. That's my plan. I'm not, the point of the Andromeda Let's Play is that it's blind. I'm not going to replay 30 odd hours 
you know, like a lot of stuff happened, like really cool things. I got my romance started, you know, like really cool things happened. And, and I want to show you guys like my frustrations and my giddiness and my, you know, my joy and anger, whatever. You know, I want to show you all what I experienced the first time around. So original commentary has to stay. My, my plan then is to go back the 30 hours and replay the game starting from that point where I lost game audio and basically what I'm what, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be watching my original video for 10 or 15 minutes and then I will be replaying it as exactly as I can create it on like doing the replay but I won't be speaking what I'm doing is basically just replaying to get the game audio and my initial plan was to like get the game audio and keep the original video you know so that way it wouldn't be, you know, different, but it would have, it would have, trying to edit that together would have killed me. Would have trying to, like, oh my gosh, trying to sync up, like, yeah, yeah, no. So what I'm going to be doing, basically, is, I don't know if this makes sense, but I will be watching the old one for just, like, 10 or 15 minutes at a time. So that way I can try to recreate as exactly as possible what I did. Um, the only thing that concerns me, honestly, the, the, the like cutscenes gonna be fine super easy to sync up my original commentary with that you know um the only thing that i'm a little bit like oh, i don't know how it's gonna work is with battles you know with fighting and stuff like that um but the battles are fairly predictable like the enemies spawn from the same places you know blah 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 um so i think i'll be able to you know if i watch very closely i'll be able to kind of at least get really close to what i did in, in each fight you know and then if i don't I will just, you know, I, there, there. This, this is where it might get a little bit choppy. I might be cutting some things out, like cutting out some fighting, cutting out some of my commentary, just especially in the fights, the cutscenes and stuff, and like dialogue interactions. It's gonna be super easy to sync up my reactions with with what's going on on the screen. You know, it'll be basically just like doing it the first time around. But what I'm gonna have to do though is edit out the 10 or 15 minute pauses, especially. This is especially where I'm maybe editing out is where I, I edit out the 10 or 15 minute pauses where I watch the next segment of my video. <laughs> and who knows how long this is going to last. But, I mean, it's going gonna, it's gonna to have to last because I want to show you guys exactly what happened and I want to keep my original commentary. It's not worth it to me if I don't. I, I, I won't be able to keep the Let's Play going if I don't keep the original commentary. And that's unacceptable to me. So it's something I'm willing to do. Be besides, and I know this is getting long. Besides, there is a pro to this. They just released the patch update the other day. And I still haven't checked it out yet. But apparently, from what little screenshots I've like glanced at and been like, oh, I can't look at it yet. Um, the faces look amazing for humans. And I think Asari as well. At least the eyes are supposed to be much more improved. So, and I was kind of actually, like, I was legitimately worried. I was like, I have like 60 episodes or more and that I've already recorded that are with the old graphics and people are gonna be like, oh my gosh, this is so horrible looking compared to how it is now. So it's kind of in a weird way, it's a good thing that this happened because now I can actually have the pretty graphics and you can bet your buns that there will be times when like mo like present me will interject where I'll like all of a sudden pause what's going on in the middle of a cutscene and I'll be like holy crap because when I see the new faces I'm gonna react to those and I'm gonna be like oh my gosh and I'll just have to like be like look at this like and I'm, I'm hoping I can be able to show like comparisons like look at how her face used to look and look at how it is now. So there will be times where like present me will like maybe interject a few times, but it won't be anything like major. I basically just want to keep the blind let's play, you know, but there will be some things that, that have changed and it'll be nice to be like, oh, look, like this is how this changed, you know, so it'll be kind of an interesting perspective to have. Um, hopefully you've made it this far in the video. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. Basically, I have my, my sister and I worked this out. I think it's going to work. Uh, I haven't actually had time to do it yet. Hopefully, I'll have time to do it, like, at the time of recording tonight or tomorrow night. I'll be able to start doing what I need to do to replay the next the, the 30 hours or so that I lost of game audio. Which, you know, I, I, mean, I am actually kind of interested to see how, how things will change with the new graphics and stuff like that. So, yeah.
So it's not all bad. <laughs> it'll be it'll be interesting, but it also means that videos might. I was doing pretty good at an hour long a day. It might be every other day because it's gonna take me at least twice as long to record and edit these new videos, <laughs> because I'm gonna have to spend literally exactly twice as much time to re-record and then a ton of time editing them into some semblance of you know working. You know, so it's gonna be an adventure. And I just wanted to let you guys know straight up what had happened. I probably won't play any further in the game at this point. There may be a couple times where I'm just like, ah, I need to play ahead at least a little bit, you know? And I'll just record, but you won't, I mean, you won't see those for a while, but yeah. So, so that's what happened. It's a bummer, but it's also good in its own way. And it is something that I think I will be able to get around, to be able to work with. So hopefully, hopefully you all can bear with it too. Um, I'll, I'll let you know how it goes. So thank you again for your patience and I hope this goes well. Thanks.